So let us today set a new national goal for science in the age of biology. Today, let us commit ourselves to developing an AIDS vaccine within the next decade. Only a truly effective preventive HIV vaccine can limit and eventually eliminate the threat of AIDS. I don't think it's too much of an exaggeration to say it's the holy grail of AIDS research. It's the thing that we're all striving for. There are th uh, three laboratories on our floor, and we all do something different mm -hmm. in the AIDS vaccine development. Gary Dable is head of the Vaccine Research Center. He says ultimately it will be necessary to recruit tens of thousands of volunteers to see if the new HIV vaccines can really protect people. Welcome to the Vaccine Research Center Clinic. The primary mission of the VRC is to develop an effective AIDS vaccine. The successful implementation of this mission is dependent on members of the public who are willing to partner with the science that believes in the power of vaccines to improve human health. At the VRC clinic, phase one human safety trials are conducted. Any flu-like symptoms? No. Healthy adults are screened by VRC recruiters and nurses for the trials. One volunteer at a time, vaccine studies designed to control infectious diseases begin to enroll helping science understand complex theories of immunology aimed at stopping viruses like HIV. Healthy volunteers are further screened by advanced practitioners and physicians to be certain they qualify for a vaccine trial. Each potential study volunteer is finally evaluated by the entire team for a specific trial. Eligibility criteria for enrollment are reviewed in detail with the initial screeners, the nurses, clinic doctors, and the physician in charge, known as the principal investigator. This is the, just the screening part, so we're not actually... The VRC clinic is designed with a variety of comfortable, quiet settings where a study subjects can provide medical history, receive reproductive and HIV counseling, be informed of study procedures, and ask questions in order to provide proper informed consent to participate in a vaccine trial. Special drug delivery devices are used to administer select so VRC investigational products. These are systems that do not need a needle to deliver precise amounts of an investigational agent into precise locations within the deltoid muscle. After receiving an injection, VRC volunteers are given what they need to be comfortable while they wait to have their vital sign evaluations at 30 and 60 minute intervals. The VRC clinic recognizes the vaccine volunteers' precious time commitment by providing spaces to read, keep up on email, or just relax with one another. Keeping the protocol schedules and efficient retention of study participants is key to successful medical research. The same is true for vaccine trials. Any chest pains? No chest pains. Flexibility of the VRC clinic staff includes the ability to see volunteers early in the morning, late in the evening, and on weekends and holidays. The VRC clinic operates with the hope of proving the safety of vaccines that stand a serious chance of minimizing the suffering wrought by emerging infectious diseases like HIV. Finding vaccines to address such threatening infections is the business of the VRC. Please, join us. We can't do it without you.